had to have ha-ha hopes for a living Shooting for the stars when I couldn't make a killing Yes! So, this song is about the lyrics. If you get the lyrics, you're going to get the whole song. Now, you might be good at lyrics. I'm really bad. I can learn, like, you know, Happy Birthday, Mary Had Little Lamb. But other than that, it takes me a long time to get the lyrics. But if you know the lyrics of the song, every rhythm, every note in the song are just like the original, right? Just like the original. So if you can listen to it, you can get it. Uh, this section is letter C to D, all right? C to D. We're going to get this section down. <laughs> Guys, I'm going to keep going because no, no, all right? I, you don't understand what goes on behind the scenes. All you need to do is you need to know. You need to <laughs> Just keep going. Just keep going. All right? See this? <laughs> See the D. That's perfect. It's C to D. All right. Thanks, guys. <laughs> On another note, sections B to C before this, they were, they were accented, staccato. The notes are short and separated, right? They're emphasized. This section the notes are connected, right? They're legato, they're slurred, right? So there's a contrast between what happened before and what's gonna happen now. So this is all connecting, so connect the notes for this section. All right, this part is awesome, all right? Wind players, this is part is great. This is our the chorus of the song, it's the part that comes back and, uh, again and again. Uh, and so when you're learning this part, um, take it very slowly, right? Don't try to go quickly, uh, take it slowly. Get the first few notes, right? Like this. Start that, right? Take it very slowly. You're gonna connect the notes. The notes are gonna be slurred. They're gonna be legato. Connect the notes, right? Here's what it sounds like all together. I'm gonna start the pickup, uh, the pickup to C. Three notes before C. I'll say one. Ba da da ba 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 da da da. All right. Here's what it sounds like. This is the wind part for letter C to D. Oh, one. slowly okay here is the piano part for letters c to d in high hopes let's just start with the left hand so it's very similar to section b to c that you just learned except um, this section repeats so um, and you also hold out the notes instead of um, playing the um, one two and three four rhythm so here's what it sounds like and then i'll break it down for you As you can see, I just played the same eight notes twice. So what you have is you have B flat, F, D, C, B flat, F, D, and A. Repeat. B flat, F, D, C, B flat, F, D, A. And for that last, that second time you play the A at the end, you want to, it's a half note, so you want to stop it um, a little bit sooner than you did the last time. So that is the left hand part for measures uh, section C to D in high hopes. Okay, here is the right hand for letters C to D in high hopes. I'm going to play it for you first, and then I will break it down and explain it a bit. So what you 
can see is I just played the same thing twice. So measures C to D, they repeat. So you're going to play eight measures and then you're going to play those same eight measures again. But the second time you play them, that last A minor chord that you have, you're just going to hold it out. So these are the same notes, the, the same chords as the last section. You have your B flat chord here and your F chord and your D minor and then C and then your B flat chord, your F chord, D minor, and then A minor. Okay, and then in the time that you repeat it, you're just gonna hold out that A minor. All right, so that is the right hands part. Now let's put both hands together. Okay, here are both hands for letters C to D in high hopes. I'm going to play it for you and then I will break it down a bit. Okay, you see, so your left hand is holding out those whole notes while your right hand is playing that one, two, and three, four rhythm. So don't freak out. Don't feel like, oh, I can't do this. Just start with one hand at a time. And then when you feel comfortable with playing both hands separately, then you can try playing with both of them together. Good luck. All right, guys, for this, for this section, you can do um, two options. Um, one, you can start with quarter note, quarter note clicks. Go like this. Or if you want to take a little more advanced, you could definitely just add the little groove we have. So it goes like this. Let's play it. get to this assignment you're going to go to smart music high hopes assignment from letter c to d whether you're advanced band or symphonic band c to d click on that log into smart music using your username and your password click home right here click on your class whether you're doing advanced band or symphonic band click view all to find this assignment again you're looking for high hopes letter c to d right here click on that Click complete assignment. Make sure you click the right instrument. If you're not sure what instrument uh, you're supposed to choose, refer back to the smart music intro video for High Hopes, the very first smart music intro video that says High Hopes smart music intro video. It, it will tell you what instrument you need to choose because there are a lot of different options, but generally uh, it will tell you. So I'm gonna click my instrument, get it ready. Trumpet, click okay. Then it loads up. It might take a little while to load because it's a large file. So just be patient. Make sure you have your headphones plugged in and your instrument ready to go. Again, this is the chorus section uh, that's going to repeat a lot in this song. So once you get this section, you've got it, right? You've got a good chunk of the song. Same instructions for the assignment. Don't worry about the red or yellow notes. Just get as many green as you can. But your goal is to make the best recording you can. Uh, you can also take the temp a slow tempo so you can make the tempo slower, all right, and do the best you can, and then we'll give you 100%. Click close. Again, right here is the tempo uh, button, so you can lower, you can reduce the tempo so that it's slower. Right. 64. I'm gonna take it at, I'm gonna take it at the uh, normal tempo here at 164. 
and you have a pickup to letter C. So it'll give you one, two, three, four, one, two, and then you come in. Press record. Again, if you're playing piano or drums, your part's going to look different. Just play whatever your part is, all right? At this point, you, you kind of have a sense of what smart music is. Just play what your part is. Piano and wind players, you're going to play melodic through microphone. Drums, you're going to press percussive through microphone. Click select this mode and device. Unplug your headphones. Test your microphone. Plug your headphones back in. Get your instrument ready, click start, and here we go. get as many green notes as you can take it slowly like we said before uh, you can do it as many times as you want you can listen back to yourself with this blue button uh, once you're done click the take that you want up here click submit make a comment if you want and then submit it let it upload it right to us and you got this the chorus letter C of high hopes this part is awesome have fun with it